I would say uh, getting to explore people and their personalities or different relationships and interactions. So getting to capture this idealized moment in time of, of a specific person and what might be going on in their head and their life at the moment, I think is really fun to explore. Cotton Candy Machine came about um, when Sean Leonard and I were brainstorming ideas um, for ways to um, make art more accessible to collectors. And so we created the art boutique in my art studio that was in Brooklyn. Um, and the store was there for five years, but unfortunately the greedy landlords took over and we decided to close that retail space but Cotton Candy Machine has evolved into an online art boutique. One of my favorite icons is Wonder Woman. It's been a big inspiration to me throughout my life. Cut to years later, Kid Robot asked me to do a Wonder Woman figure um, and to do her in my own style. And it was just an absolute dream project where I had to say, oh my gosh, yes. So I got the awesome opportunity to create these beautiful figures. For me, as an illustrator, I wouldn't say that it's changed very much the way that, that I approach my projects because illustration work has always been um, a priority for me and that's been a goal of mine from the get-go even when I was in art school. So getting, getting to have this crossover into pop culture isn't um, anything new. You have to work really hard. It's not only having this inherent talent, it's about having the discipline and make sacrifices in life for the better good of your art career. Meeting fun fans.